Hello everyone, I'm Daniel, I'm from the beautiful island of Capri, and I used to mod Skyrim a lot, I used to mod the Elder Scrolls game a lot, and back in a uh, few years ago, uh, when Skyrim went up in the market, I created a guide for mod Skyrim named Skyrim Total Enhancement Project, which is now a very well-established guide on the internet, if you, if you Google it. And I used to mod Skyrim because I liked the way uh, you can interact with every NPC, with every um, element of the world in Skyrim. Because every element of the world in the Elder Scrolls game is really dynamic. Uh, there is the Radiant AI, which allows to, uh, the NPCs to basically do uh, normal daily life stuff. And I like this aspect, so I try to um, improve this aspect in, in, in Skyrim by, by modding it. But I failed because I uh, because the game was not tailored for this, was not created for this reason. The game was just a fake dynamic system. I wanted a game that is really dynamic, uh, in which there is really um, a, an ecosystem going on. There is really nature working on, on it. So I created a dino system. In this game. There is a whole ecosystem with dinosaurs which evolves over time, in which there are plants, in which there are lakes, in which there is terrain changing in fertility, aridity, and so on. And you can see in the first slide here that there are four uh, days, four years basically. Uh, in the first one, there is a very small lake at the center of the map, and in the other one, you see many years later that. Everything changes around this lake. That there is a, 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 a forest emerging, and the lake expands because there are there is rain. And later, there is a wind fight from everything. So this is the purpose of the game, basically. No, I'm, I'm just joking. Uh, this is not the purpose of the game. But you can do whatever you want to do with the ecosystem. You can just destroy it. You can make it thrive. You can see what happens if you introduce a new species inside the ecosystem. And you can see here the Trudon and Mummy Trudon with these babies. And uh, in this game there is an intelli a intelligent AI, but uh, it's more intelligent than many games, uh, in which, uh, that allows animals to raise their babies to lay eggs, to care for the youngs, and to reproduce. So they just survive. Way they would do in nature. Uh, and you can see what happens if you introduce a new species in this ecosystem and how she tries to raise her babies in this new world and how she competes with other animals in this ecosystem. Uh, these are all the animals in this game now, which are not many, but every species is, uh, has its own AI with, that allows it to do basically everything. Survive in the world, and uh, every animal rises, grows from egg to adult animal, and uh, gets old and dies of uh, out of, the, of uh, old age. Um, you can name various parts of the island. Uh, I, I remind you that the island changes all the time, according to how seasons, according to seasons, according to. Um, Disasters, uh, asteroids, volcanic eruptions, etc. And you can name various parts of the island in order to uh, see, to, to, re to remember the place you visited previously. And here you can also enter and be part of the world of Dino System and survive inside it as a human. Now, I know that humans didn't live with dinosaurs because this is not scientific at all. Uh, but this is a game, so I will probably uh, create a, uh, a story behind this to justify this unscientific fact. But uh, I want to also do survival mode, because this is the name of the mode in which you can survive inside the island, inside the ecosystem, to be very, very complex as well, as well as the ecosystem part is. So there are very complex body mechanics uh, in this game. You can grow muscle, you can uh, burn fat, you can Increase your metabolism, you can increase your skills, and even uh, lose your ability to in some uh, skills if you don't use the 
played with the pedri a lot. And in, in this light, there is a very fun character, but you can also uh, burn fat and become very slim. Uh, this is how the metabolic system works in the dino system. As you can see, there are very complex mechanics involved in, in the uh, metabolism. And I have also similar graphics for other aspects of the body mechanics as well. And uh, in, at the end, in the survival, you can also do everything you can do in other games about survival. You can hunt, you can uh, build stuff, you can build buildings, you can build, uh, you can craft items to, to help you survive, you can involve uh, your technology base, basically. And uh, your body, as well as the ecosystem itself in which you live, will evolve over time, according to how you survive inside the island. And you have to be very careful in how you survive, because if you hunt a species of animal too much, it can become extinct, and the whole ecosystem will collapse, or will adjust, and will change. So you won't be able to survive in the same way if you change this, if you change the ecosystem which is survive too much. And, finish? Okay, thank you.